pound of peanut brittle. Yeah. Two batches of peanut brittle. Grandpa's scale <laughs> still works. How old do you think the scale is? Well, my grandfather, <laughs> it's got to be near a hundred at least. Yeah. Uh, okay, sugar. Oops, I didn't move the scale. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Forty-seven. Forty-seven pounds. Forty-seven. <laughs> With fourteen pounds of sugar. Yeah, and ten pounds of corn syrup. Yep. Wow. Mm. It's like I've made a lot of videos and you remember it how much. Mm, good job. <laughs> After a couple of videos I remember. And then remember it's two quarts of water. Yep. Put this over there now. And then how much uh, salt and baking soda do you, do you guys use? Ounce and a half of salt and uh, eight ounces of baking soda. Oh, okay. I have to get the full one again. Whatever it's called. Oh, geez, a low. And then. And then. <laughs> Mix it up first, and then we'll turn the heat on. Okay. And then put the thermometer in after you're done mixing. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you can could harm your thermometer. How would you harm your thermometer? Just from bashing it around when you're mixing? Yeah, yeah you could hit it with the paddle. Oh, okay. Especially when you got an antique for a thermometer. Yeah, it works great. I'm a, I'm not changing it. That's yeah. what I use for all the candy. Yeah. Don't change it unless you have to. No. Every thermometer is always a, a degree or something different. You know, mm -hmm. it's always. Well, I go by this old one, but. Yeah. I'll, I'll stick with it. Yeah. I don't want to spend money unless I have to. Yeah. Okay, well, fire it up. Ready? Yeah. Can I see it under there? Can you see it? Mm, I can hear it. Oh, there we go. I'll put the thermometer in. Okay, now we're on to peanuts. I gotta get peanuts. Spanish peanuts. try to glance at them too just in case there's a peanut stalk. Mm -hmm. Sometimes a peanut stalk gets away in there. Hmm. Somehow they don't get picked up. Hmm. Oh, there is one. Yep. Peanut oh, wow. stalk. Huh. Boil and so you put the peanuts in. Just once it gets up to a rapid boil. Yep, once it starts boiling, you just uh, 
it's time for the peanuts. You add raw peanuts. Raw peanuts. If you're cooking at home, making peanut brittle, you probably can't get raw peanuts. So if you're using roasted peanuts, just put them in the last five minutes of the batch. And that way they won't be uh, overcooked. And there, and then we'll just put the top on. Give it a stir every few minutes, every few minutes and we'll be all set. Because you don't bang that thermometer on the side of the the kettle to get the other stuff off? I want it to last another hundred years. It's not disposable. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a pro tip. Don't whack on the side of the kettle. Yeah. You'd be surprised people will do that. Mm -hmm. yep. you, you guys have had people do that in the past? Yep. yep. Nameless, nameless people? Yep. We broke them. Oh. You guys have gone through a and couple of those? The batch had to be thrown away. Oh yeah, because it breaks in there, huh? Yeah, yeah people hate glass in their candy. And mercury. Yeah. Mercury glass. Whatever. Yeah. But whatever's in your Metal. thermometer. They just, it's so finicky. Yeah. I mean, first of all, no hair. <laughs> no hair? Wow, now they're just taking all, all the fun away from making candy <laughs> and eating it. How about hair balls? <laughs> it's only for cat food. <laughs> oh, okay. Looking good. Thank you. And the brittle. Mm -hmm. Good one, Dad. All the hard candies, this is one is like the least labor intensive, right? Because it's only like 15, 10, 15 minutes of. I think it is. Yeah. Your father, it, I mean, it, your father finds it more labor intensive because he's picking up and putting down the I'm metals. the one doing it. Yeah, yeah but I'm, I'm just talking about compared to other hard oh, candy yeah, where like you're standing easier. in front of a heater for yeah. hours. Yep, this is the easier one. And then, yeah. you know, because you, your dad does the, um, he lifts and he lifts the kettles and whatnot. And then also he picks up the brittle off the counter and cases it up. So this is pretty much his baby. I come in here, I come in here, dump it, stretch it, walk away. Hmm. Ooh, that was a little, a little too close for comfort. Mm -hmm. Apparently to my lens too. <laughs> Fogging her up. I'm so happy the marble table's here. Yeah, I know what, this is great. Well, if they couldn't have gotten it out. It's the most uncertain part of the whole move. <clears throat> I'm sure the people enjoyed the, the video about moving the marble slab table, huh? Mm -hmm. Is it up? Yep. They were asking for it. Oh yeah. So you gave it to them? Yeah. When did you put it up? Uh, yesterday. How many views have you got? Uh, a million? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want to say around 30,000 or so. Yeah, it was 22 yesterday. 22,000. Mm -hmm. I should look at our YouTube channel, but I just, I don't have time.
Don't get in her way. <laughs> you might find yourself half price. That's super sharp. Well, this is a big, huge sharpening stone. stone. Across that table. stone. It's a sharpening a long, stone. Long time. <laughs> so for a few minutes there, we made an ASMR video, didn't we? Yeah, we did. That's what I was kind of going for. It was nice of us to quit yapping for a few minutes, huh? You didn't even tell us to. You just did. <laughs> mm -hmm. so this was a spontaneous ASMR. It just broke out. Mm -hmm. Please, help me to stop. <laughs> Somebody stop me. Please. Wow. Thank you, Dad. She would have just kept going forever. Well, I don't know where to stand. I'm not used to being able to go around and around and around. You yeah. should do something to stop me. I don't know where to stop. What are you thinking, honey? <laughs> You're so cute. I know. <laughs> he had on his she's so cute face. Like, yeah. No. Okay, uh, cutie, can you cut that? Sure, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> this this isn't oh, sickening or anything. Hey, wait a minute. Okay. Okay, wait a minute. Hey, Mom, <laughs> he just said wait. And what did you do? You didn't wait. Mom, no crying in the candy. She's naughty. Do I have time to go stand in the corner? After this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, my office is in the corner. Does that count? <laughs> yeah, you're going to have to I'm go busy. do work. I'm going to for punishment. some more um, cleaning supplies. Hmm. You put the mic under there for a second. Okay, thanks. I'm ordering some professional window cleaning too. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you notice. We have a lot of windows. Yeah, now you do. Did you know that you clean windows with dish soap and water? I did. You told me that last video. Dish soap and water. <laughs> but what if it's not on the... What yeah. about window soap? No, it's dish soap. Oh. Don't would you use hand use, soap. Would you use window soap on your dishes? Mm. No, I don't think so. Hmm? Depends on the ingredients. Okay. So should I cut this or what? No. You can pick it up again a little. So what are you looking for when you pick it up? Just well, kind of like a droop test? Yeah, if it's too, it's too soft, I, I won't make it over there. Yeah. Under the counter. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's more brittle. <laughs> then it'll be sad, Steve. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you just kind of know what to feel for? Yeah, if it stretches too, too much. So it's just another type it's of a It's kind of like test. trial and error. It's, it's another droop test. <laughs> yeah. No way to really tell people. Well, folks at home, they don't really have to put it on another, their surface. They can just stretch it where they are. Yeah, they're probably not making such a big okay, batch that they need to it really out. cut it. And where are you going with this one? Right here. Right there? Okay. And then right where you are. Okay. Oh, a close one. All right, I gotta get back to work. I noticed that yeah. it's, it's cooler than um, you know the last batch that we did at least. Yeah. That's what I found in mine anyway. And yeah. I guess Dad's gonna find it. It's too thing. soft on the table, but then it got cold quick. Have so. you found that like this type of metal cools anything quicker than the other type of metal you had at the other place? Mm -hmm. the same. No, it's about the same. I don't see any difference. Yeah. I mean they're both metal, so a little bit of huge.
<laughs> I got it. Gotta get mean. You gotta get angry. Stretch it. Man versus brittle. Woman versus brittle. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, Dad. Did you do that? We should probably have a Jeezaloo t-shirt, huh, Trent? Yeah. Jeez I think I had one, but uh, we should we should sell one here. Yeah. Mike's the one a that sells one. that all yeah. the time. Jeezaloo. Jeezaloo. And fiddlesticks. <laughs> yeah. And fiddlesticks. Cowboy cursing. Well, no, not cowboy cursing. Dad cursing. <laughs> good, job. good job, Craig. Thanks. You know, getting better and stuff. Yeah. That's good. So we just have one more batch, is that correct? Yep. Sweet. Cool. What's Craig putting in his pizza? Um, I think I'm going to have one barbecue pizza and one marinara. I do like pineapple. I'm, pineapple I'm aware one. of that. Yeah. I got that memo. I know, I think like, I, it's like pretty divisive. Like you either love pineapple on your pizza or you hate it. Huh, I could, I don't really care. So I don't know if I should have that on the video because it might get a little heated Ooh. in the comments section. Yeah, we don't need that. That's all we need. This has kind of been a drama free channel. Yeah. Now you just opened a big old can of yeah. pineapple. Yeah. <laughs> big old can of pineapple. Yeah. This one. We have a. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. What are you gonna say? <laughs> call me the That's shredder for no reason. Perfect. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Just saving you a little time. Hmm. 